As I promised, in the week of August, we're going to talk about the enhancement of certain sexual functions. And on this occasion, we're shifting away from a woman. We're talking about enhancing a man's sexual function through testosterone. Of course, we all know that the testosterone itself are produced by the testicle themselves. The testicle has got a type of cells called Leydig cells. And these cells are influenced by certain things. For example, the state of health of a person. And that includes no diabetes, no obesity, no high blood pressure and no high cholesterol. And men who are healthy clearly will produce more testosterone. Other things that actually will improve testosterone include sleep because our testosterone production is controlled by circadian cycle. And if you sleep well, more than several cycles of deep sleep, then the Leydig cells will really behave well and produce a lot of testosterone for you. Other things that will influence it, including exercise, hydration, and less stress. Of course, all these things are easier said than done. If you want to have a shortcut and want to boost your sexual function, there's a way which we will give you testosterone replacement therapy. If a man is diagnosed with late onset hypogonadism, meaning you have low testosterone as an adult, then we need to replace it. The whole strategy is called testosterone replacement therapy. And it comes in several forms. For example, it can come in a patch, injection, oral treatment, and also even nasal spray and deodorant. And all these have different ways of delivering testosterone to men at a steady pace so that it doesn't have this yo-yo effect and actually get men into these roller coasters of emotion driven by different levels of hormone. What are the risks? There are of course risks associated to any form of treatment. For men who has got prostate cancer, no, no, you cannot have testosterone replacement therapy. Other things including if you've got enlarged prostate to the verge of causing blockage, not so suitable. And some men has got a condition called polycythemia, meaning that your red blood cell is way too high and the injection of testosterone will make it even more higher, causing problems of clot in their bloodstream. So therefore, before you even contemplating having testosterone, go and see your doctor because the testosterone replacement therapy really will require stringent scrutiny and monitoring. As we shift away from men's sexual function and women's sexual function, we're going to talk about couple sexual function, how to enhance this. Of course, if somebody is finding the actual sexual activity a bit mundane and contemplating several ways to boost and spice up that activity between the sheets, then something like a sex toy might be in their minds. So if you are toying with that idea, then you stay tuned for next week's Putting Dr. G on the Spot. <laughs>